now you can like I said create different instances of an object so this dog Sam is completely different from this dog Fido and they each have their own different variables so if I printed out Sam's name it would print out of course Sam not Fido um, although they do have stuff in common like if Sam barked here it's going to be the exact same output as when Fido barks so Let's try making a dog that is exactly the same as the old dog, Fido 2. Now obviously the name is going to be the same, Fido. The age is going to be the same, 3. So let's try... comparing the two. Now wait a second. Fido 1 is exactly the same as Fido 2. So why is it not equal? Well, yes, they are the same. They seem exactly the same. They have all the same variables. But they aren't actually equal because two objects no matter how similar they are, can never be equal. That's really the best way to look at it. I could tell you the complicated way that Java actually doesn't store objects to sources, locations, and memory. But that's not really important. Just remember that objects are not equal to each other just because they have the same variables. You can use different methods to compare to see if they have all the same variables, but you have to create those methods yourself. And I will show you that with those methods you can actually compare. And this should return true. Yep. So you can't compare them like other variables. That's very important to remember. And even strings. If I have the string, uh, hello. If you do this, it's not actually true. Oh, I guess it is with those type of strings. Let me make instances of them. I mentioned before that the strings are objects. So, what the hell? Ah, never mind, they must have updated Java 6 so that it actually does compare strings like that. Um, but normally, that's not true. Uh, strings do, of course, then still have the equals method and we'll print this out of course it's true um, but you'll see that this is not true because like I've said over and over Java is case sensitive you can bypass the case sensitive part in this situation though if you do equals ignore case and 
and once again they're true. <laughs> okay, so next video we're actually going to be talking about making your own objects. Um, I probably won't use cat and dog, I might use ball or something. Uh, so, go to the website. It's www.johns. No, it's just johnsjava.webs.com. Uh, I'll have all of these posted as well as an activity to do to teach you a little bit more about objects. It'll probably use these same objects. Okay, see you later. Searching for